I'd like to introduce you to Canva, a amazing tool for creating classroom image-based projects. Canva is awesome uh, because it has so many um, ready-to-go templates, super easy to use, and the designs are absolutely beautiful. Uh, Canva is free to use. They do have a premium option, uh, but you do not need a premium account. I'll show you how to work within the um, free version, and everything I'll show you is uh, included in that uh, free version. You can sign up for Canva using your school G Suite account, and so uh, it's easy for your students to get signed up as well. We're going to create a uh, quote card, which is a fun way for students to select uh, an important passage from a book or historical figure and then share it with the class. So we're into Canva right now, and um, it's all based on uh, design templates. So Canva has thousands and thousands of options. So the first thing you're going to do is just select from um, these options here, and it's really based on size. So you want to do you want a poster? You trying to put you know an Instagram style image, a flyer, a bookmark, a blog banner? Um, you should give your students some guidelines in terms of what size you want them to use. Let's go ahead and just do a social media. Um, uh, design. Now, once we've selected our base design, we're going to see hundreds of uh, design templates. Some of them are free some of them are not. And as long as you pick from the free options, so you can see on each design it says free, eventually you'll get down to one that'll have a dollar sign on it. And if you wanted to use that or the elements um, of it, you'd have to pay for it. But there's hundreds and hundreds of free ones. Uh, shouldn't be a, a restrictive at all. So um, I'm just going to scroll through here and look for something that um, might work well for me. Um, so let's do this one here. I'm going to use as my base. Um, so I've already copied the quote. This is from Herb Brooks, the legendary coach of the uh, men's U.S. Olympic team uh, that beat the Soviet Union. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, readjust the size a little bit. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and edit the text below to give him credit. Herb Brooks, Olympic men's hockey coach. Now, uh, the image that is there is uh, obviously not going to work, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, click on um, the uh, elements icon and select from photos. Now, I can upload my own or I can pick from uh, the images they have. So, you know, here's your upload button. I'm going to go ahead and uh, just search for uh, mountains, kind of a inspirational background kind of a quote. Again, as we look through here, you're going to see some that say free and some that are a dollar. As long as you pick the free ones, you're good to go. And I'm just going to drag that image and replace the one that's there. Looks pretty good. And then uh, go ahead and select that background. Not a huge fan of the pink. Let's go with uh, blue. I'll hit the transparency, make that a little more opaque. Um, there we go. And that's how easy it can be. Now I can add an additional uh, page. I can download this as um, an image, a PDF. So you'll you know, give your students directions on how you want them to save their image and you're ready to go. Canva is a wonderful tool for creating simple graphic projects in the classroom for any age students.